Hi everybody, this is Jennifer O'Toole from AK and I want to wish you a happy Mother's Day. Well, that is if you live in the U.S. and you are anything other than East Coast time, which is what I'm in. So technically it's 24 minutes after Mother's Day here. But it's only now that I've actually finished um, this boatload of paperwork that I needed to do for my kids, teachers, and for 504s and the special speak that we all know and the extra bonus and the sticky notes that have to go here and here and here to make sure everybody actually gets done what they need to without falling apart in the morning, which is still a possibility, but you know, hey, it's the lunch pad, right? Okay, here's the deal, ladies. End of Mother's Day, or perhaps still going. And you may notice, generally, when I film or appear, do stuff, I'm not in my pajamas. I'm not wearing the, the tank and the, the Marvel, you know, pants there. Um, the hair is, like, you know, down and done. I believe right now it's being held back with some kind of, possibly a safety... Not a, not a safety pin, a paper clip. Yes, yes. Um, I'm wearing fuzzy socks. And I'm wearing a tiara that says happy birthday. It's not my birthday. It's not my tiara. I don't care. Here's why. I don't know about you, and I really do hope you had the kind of mother day, Mother's Day that involved, oh, sunshine, or perhaps massages, or perhaps pretty sparkly things. Whatever. Whatever it was that you wanted, I hope you got it. But if you had a Mother's Day that was a little bit more like mine, which involved a reservation that at a, at a fancy restaurant my mom wanted to go to, um, and hey, she was the mom first, so, you know, but required me to bring, <laughs> um, you know, a Harry Potter coloring book and um, high quality coloring pencil things even for my teenager because nobody could stay still that long, you know. In other words, that which is easy for everybody else and expected, we all know, is not for us, right? Okay. I don't know about you, but my day, which I was really hoping to end with some karaoke and board, board games. That's what I wanted. That's what I wanted. This is simple things in life. Karaoke and board games. Mm-hmm. That did not happen. Instead, we we descended into a mad tirade of of overtired school related, homework related, makeup work from last week related issues with my one kid going into a full meltdown because when things were supposed to have been done, I was helping another child over the weekend with another activity and unless it was me. You don't need the specifics. I can just tell you it was two and a half hours of not rose petal scented Mother's Day bliss. Two and a half hours. And that takes its toll on everybody. I mean, I'm not going to pretty it up, right? Like, that's one of my promises for AK is that I keep it real. And yeah, there is a toll on the other on the other kids, even if they're all on the spectrum, which they are, even if you're mom and you love everybody, there's still part of you that goes, dang it, come on, it's Mother's Day. One day. One hour. So, that is precisely why I decided at 12.20 now, 8 a.m. to record this fabulous video in my fabulous tiara and fuzzy socks. And... The last of one. Now, should you care not to imbibe, I do not mind. Grab a Diet Coke, grab some orange juice, perhaps coffee, whatever floats your boat. Here's the deal. If your Mother's Day made you feel special because you got handmade presents and a massage and a day out and everything that you wanted, God bless you and I am so very glad for you. And if it descended into chaos 
that made you want to run away screaming? Made you think, I am doing everything. What is going on? Well, I can tell you once again, sometimes I have to listen to my own advice. It's funny how that works. I forget. Um, the issue had nothing to do. It was all about anxiety. Had nothing to do what, with what was obvious. When I could see that, mind you, this was after he went to sleep and after all had descended into chaos. And I still had two and a half hours ahead of me of school work, paperwork, testing at work ahead, la di da di da di da. I guess I realized this and I wanted to share it. If that was your Mother's Day, the pretty kind, I truly, truly rejoice for you. And if yours was the unpretty kind, then I tell you this, sometimes you're celebrated, obviously, and sometimes you're celebrated by kids and by people who show you how desperately they need you in the least pretty ways. The most sincere, real, authentic, vulnerable, brave, least pretty ways. So from one tiara wearing diva, not so much of a diva, just the tiara we're in at this point. In my pajamas and my fuzzy socks, I raise a glass to you, my sisters, and I say two things. One, I have now hereby decided what will be the first <sighs> online course at AK for us adults, you know, complete with playlists and deliciousness gonna be called me LC. I just came up with that like now right now you know why because we need this we need somebody to say it didn't look pretty but it looked real and this is a very real cheers to you my sisters happy Mother's Day from me from everybody at AK most of all, from those kids. Because maybe the, the tougher your day was, the more they proved how much you matter. And if you don't think that is true, well, how many of you are going to appear on international video stuff and your you no know, makeup and hair done with the not doneness with the PJs and the tiara. Just saying that right there, that's keeping it real. That's love, baby. Happy Mother's Day. I mean it. And uh me LC, yeah, let's do that thing, shall we? Here's to you girls. Happy Mother's Day. Mm -hmm.